Well, hey there, folks. How are you doing? Lovely to see you again as usual. And it's been a minute. It's only been a couple of days, but I feel as though there's been that much going on the last few days that I haven't been on here for ages. But yeah, it's only been a couple of days. So welcome back. And like I said, lovely to see you. And this week we've gone to Aldi again. You know, you just cannot argue with the value. And also picked up a few things from Tesco as well that I couldn't get from Aldi. If you're new and it's your first time here, my name's Cheryl. We are a family of four from the west coast of Scotland and I'll just give you a quick look at the receipts. So that was the wee receipt there from Tesco. Didn't need much at all from Tesco. The bulk was done from Aldi and I've got a few things to collect from the local butcher as well. Just haven't managed to get there yet. So I got some eggs. I tend to buy eggs, you know, if I've got a bit of bacon to do because we don't eat many eggs. So if you see eggs in my shopping, it's usually for some kind of bacon. Some mozzarella cheese, a couple of tubs of double cream and some mayonnaise as well. Mr. Watts for teas, trifles as usual and also also a cucumber. We've been having quite a bit of salad recently, so I'm getting more cucumbers than normal. Some of the wee baby salad potatoes for a change from our bigger ones. We've not been having much mashed potato and stuff recently. Some mixed chilies, a wee lemon, and then some chestnut mushrooms. These sweet pointed peppers I thought looked nice for a wee change from the usual peppers and then the smoked cheese we're going to be having burgers and then I changed my mind last minute so I don't know what I'm going to use this in but we will use it probably toasties or maybe a roll or a sandwich or something but yeah that looks fab then these bananas are a bit in the green side but they'll be fine eventually a couple of bags of salad as well and these big tomatoes I thought looked really nice they're ripe and ready to go they look really juicy actually they look fab and then some smoked ham. I'm going to be doing pizzas. So I thought I'd pop some of that on the pizzas. Some cooked beetroot. I love beetroot. Mr. What's for tea and the girls are not fans of vinegar. So this one does not have vinegar in it. But yeah, I can just add vinegar to mine. And then some bacon medallions. I was going to be doing bacon baguettes as well. And then me and Mr. What's for tea were going to be having fish and chips one night. So that's what the fish is for. I'm going to be doing a pavlova. So I thought this sauce would be lovely for over the top. Tuna, tuna pasta bake mix. Having it this for a wee while. Just add your own stuff and it's really quick and easy. We're going to be having steak one night. So this peppercorn sauce will be handy. Some flaked almonds for the pavlova. Four pack of beans. We go through those like you wouldn't believe. Some bake at home baguettes and I also got some ciabatta rolls as well so there's four in there so I was going to do pesto, mozzarella and tomato ciabatta rolls. Tear and share bread for some sort of pasta that we will be having at some point, some mini corn in the cobs for the freezer and then these were the wee pizza bases that I found. There are two in here. So it'll just be me and Mr. Watts for tea. And these look like the proper fluffy Italian ones. So I'm looking forward to trying those. Some pot scourers. And then some cheap crisps. Just for the side of soup and rolls or something. This is the water that I like. It's a wee bit dearer. But it's got such a lovely clean flavour. Some cloths. Some bin liners. And then some flushable wipes as well. And that was everything that I got between Tesco and Aldi. But like I said, I do have a few bits to pick up from the local butcher as well. So just before I move on, I wanted to say, as usual, a huge thank you to the supporters of the channel over on my Patreon page and to the channel members here on YouTube as well. And for you all for watching and leaving your lovely comments. And I do try and respond to as many as I can, but I'm sure you can appreciate now there's about 113,000 of you. And I get comments from, you know, videos that I've done years ago and they're not in any order. You know, they just come through and I just answer as many as I can but yeah it's just impossible now to answer every single one of them so apologies if you've asked a question or commented you know I'm not ignoring you it's just that I haven't seen it and it's as simple as that so I'm going to go off now and thank you once again for watching and I will catch up with you during the week for another wee recipe shopping unboxing or whatever comes my way or even back on Sunday for meals of the week and the winner of your degusta box for this month and if you're not following me over on Instagram yet, I'm what's for t 3 over there and it would be lovely to see you. And I've got, a, I've got a bit of a sore throat here, so I keep swallowing. So apologies for that if you're aware of that as well. So like I said, I'm going to go off now. I am rambling again, but you have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll catch up with you off soon. Bye now.